open up your QGIS for desktop and this tutorial is going to show you how to install some plugins so that you can see uh, satellite imagery and some other useful tools from the web. So go up to plugins at the top menu, go to manage and install plugins, search for open or open layers and then go over to not installed and that'll give you a list of available plugins. Um, search just for layers and we're looking for the open layers plugin so scroll down to that click on it and then click install plugin give it a second to install okay and then we're gonna install another one so go back up to the search bar search for uh, QU and scroll down we're looking for quick map services so click on it and then click install plugin and let it install like the other one and then click close and we'll close out of this window then go up to web and down to quick map services and you can see the list of things that are included in that plugin so go to OSM and then over to OSM standard and you'll see the world map and let's zoom in to the Lake Victoria region uh, zoom in near Kampala, Uganda and keep going you can see that this particular layer has roads, uh, place names and some habitat. So zoom in to that green area that's showing a wetland. Zoom in to Bugolobi. That looks interesting. Um, and I don't know what that is. So we're going to go to web and open quick map services or um, open layers plugin and then go to Bing and then Bing Aerial so that'll turn on the satellite imagery so that we can see what we're looking at and if you right click on OSM standard in your table of contents you can adjust the transparency so increase it so that you can see through that layer and then put it on top just drag it so it's on top of Bing Aerial so you can see both layers at the same time, standard and then the imagery sort of showing through from underneath. Go up to web. Uh, you can see that there's quite a few different options. Um, Google Maps, other Bing Maps, and also in Quick Map Services there's other options. Zoom out near Kampala. Uh, and you can see we still have both layers on top of each other. Um, there's the whole Lake Victoria region and you can see place names from OSM standard and then the satellite imagery showing through from underneath and if we zoom in near Injera um, we can zoom into a landing site and see what that looks like on the satellite imagery road names things like that show up so that's it. Now you know how to install and use the imagery plugins.